Hi, I'm Mike Hudson, director of the Museum of the American Printing House for the Blind. Our mystery object this week comes from the age of Sputnik, that strange Russian satellite that was launched in 1957 and sent the American educational community into a tizzy because there was this sudden feeling that America was falling behind in critical areas of technology and math, and that uh, American youth did not know math. Um, and so there was this, a lot, there was a lot of response to that. There was this thing called the new math, um, which I'll let you look up on uh, Wikipedia, but um, was rejected. But there were a lot of people investigating new ways to make math more fun. And there was this guy in Wisconsin, uh, uh, Marquette University, named Andrew Schott, who came up with this individualized math program. And at APH in 1962, um, our researchers looked at the shot system and said, you know, this could be easily adapted to uh, work with kids who are blind or low vision. Um, and shot system use a bunch of different, very tactile aids like the number aid, right, which is just a, an abacus, right, with nice colored uh, beads. But, um, uh, and, and there was a geometrade and a, a bunch of different fill-in-the-blank aids, right? Protract aid, all designed to make math, geometry, all those things fun for kids. Um, and when it was adapted for use uh, for the kids that the American Printing House serves, they realized that they needed a calculating tool that wasn't in the shot system, but would, would, would piggyback with the shot system. And so they came up with this. This is our mystery object this week. This is called the Calculate. Okay. So the Calculate here um, is all made out of plastic, kind of a, a different colors of cream and white plastic. It's got these two bars on the side that hold these, this other um, columnar uh, series of, of plastic bars that have these little wheels on them, right? Um, and these wheels are octagonal. And as you turn them, you, uh, each face of each of these little wheels, those little oct octagons, have a braille number, a braille character, a braille symbol that stands for a number. And um, there are uh, five columns of five rows, right? So a grid of five by five uh, of these little wheels. Right. And then up at the top is this little frame with these little brackets on it. And you would take your number aid, which was one of the shot aids, and you could attach it to your calculate at the top. It would fit into that little bracket. But we don't really talk about the number aid today. Um, we talk about the calculate, right? So basically, this is just a way to do columnar arithmetic, right? You would set your, uh, you know, your problems up. Um, and you had five, um, five positions in it. Um, and you can either do subtraction or addition or multiplication or division on the calculate. It was just a way of recording your math problem. We have lots of similar types of uh, 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 things in the museum collection that would allow you to record the steps of your math problem. But the calculate is just a very interesting one. Um, we sold it from about 1964 until about 1968. And by then, a lot of the thing, a lot of the math tools that had been introduced to fight the Russian menace had, uh, had receded into, uh, into distant memory as uh, America launched its own uh, men to the moon.